Hi you guys, welcome back to another vlog. My name is Lauren if you're new. It's a little bit after 9.30 and I have a few things that I wanna get done this morning. I have my best friend, Taylor. Her birthday dinner is tonight. Her birthday is actually today. So I'm gonna be getting ready for that. So I wanted to get a lot of the stuff done like out of the house and in the house done before I showered if that makes sense. What I mainly want to get done today is I'm in such a spring cleaning mood. I want to go through like everything and clean stuff out. I've been like going through my closet and making a pile to donate. I want to go through my cabinets, make piles to donate and just get rid of some stuff that we don't use. We've already been in our apartment for almost a year now, which is so crazy. I feel like we just moved in. Christian and I also just re-signed our lease. So we're gonna be living here for, we re-signed our lease for like 15 months. And then hopefully at the end of that, we'll be ready to buy a house. I haven't really talked about stuff like that on my channel yet. We re-signed our lease and then hopefully by next year we'll be like ready to buy a house. I'm very traditional with stuff like that and it's just something that I believe in. Like I wanna be like engaged or married before I buy a house with someone. I think by like after 15 months of our next lease, I think we'll either be like engaged or I think we'll be planning to get engaged so I know by that time we'll be ready to buy a house and I've never shared stuff like that on my channel but yeah Christian and I have been together for four years so I feel like by next year we'll just be ready to take that next step so yeah so if you guys are ever curious about something like that <laughs> there's that but um, we've been there for a year, so I feel like I'm just like ready to go through stuff and reorganize stuff and get stuff ready to go again, you know, just like organize. So I'm going to Whole Foods and um, then I'm gonna go to Target and get some like organization stuff. I ordered some stuff off of Target online that's getting shipped to me for my closet. I ordered more baskets because they were on sale for like, they were 50% off. So I ordered them online and they should be coming next week. So in the next vlog, I'll probably be doing my closet and like kind of organizing it a little bit more on the top shelf area. I really want to get that organized. And then I kind of just like want to reorganize some of the cabinets in the kitchen and um, get rid of some stuff and just like declutter and get rid of things that we don't use or need or like want to hang on to. Our apartment's obviously small. It's like 700 square feet. So we don't have a, a ton of space to have clutter and I hate clutter. I hate just having cabinets full of stuff that I don't like regularly use. So that's on the agenda for today. Just getting some stuff done. Then I have Taylor's birthday dinner tonight. Yeah, we're just gonna have a little day. Let's go to Whole Foods and Target. super coffee it's like zero added sugar 10 grams of protein 200 milligrams of caffeine and i got it in the vanilla it's super coffee I've never tried it it's not my fave i'm not i'm not obsessed with it i don't think it's that good my hair looks frizzy I don't know. It's not my fave, but I got a green juice as well. The Green Aid, which is my favorite one from Whole Foods. It's apple, celery, spinach, kale, and lemon. Okay, I just got home from Target. So I got these two 
big baskets and then I got like a smaller one. I'm obviously gonna return whatever I don't end up using so I'm gonna keep the tags on it for now. And then I got this but I realized that I had one in the pantry that I kind of was just filling with random stuff because it was just extra. So I don't know if I'm gonna end up keeping that or not. And then I also got some blueberry muffin mix. I meant to get it from Whole Foods this morning, but I forgot. And I wanted to get the Simple Mills brand, but Target didn't have that. So I got Betty Crocker Wild Blueberry. And the reason I got some muffin mix was because I got a package in from Caraway, and I've worked with them before in the past. And I have a discount code, it's 10% off. I'll link it in the description box and I'll also put it on the screen. But I recently got the half bakeware set, I believe is what it's called. And it comes with a medium baking sheet, a 12 cup muffin pan, a large half baking sheet, and a rectangular pan. And it also comes with this great storage caddy and you can unclip it this way, pull them out this way. And it easily organizes the pans in your cabinet. So I wanted to use the muffin tin, but we got it in this gray color, which matches the pan set that I got. And I did a whole video on, so I'll, I'll link that video down below. This is just something that, you know, you don't think to buy for yourself, but when you do, you realize like you're missing out on some nice pans. So, and it has little dividers in there as well. And it also comes with more of these, um, I think they're called trivets. They are for when you take something out of the oven or off the, the hot stove and you put it on the counter, you put it on this first. But this is the pan set that we have from Caraway. So we got it in the same gray color and they have these great storage containers that are magnetic. But, so I'm excited to have this and use. So, I was thinking about storing it in here, but I obviously need to do some serious work with organizing the cabinets, I feel like. I also want to get rid of some cups and donate them and potentially order new ones. This cabinet is a little bit messy. Kind of want to find new places for stuff like this, maybe get rid of some stuff and figure that out. <laughs> I just have a lot of stuff back there as well. So that's what I'm tasking today and that's why I got these to try and better organize the kitchen and I want to do these drawers we only have three drawers in the kitchen look at this drawer it's a mess so I grabbed the other brown container that we had in the pantry that I was using to just store random stuff and I'm thinking about some of this stuff we don't like use on a daily basis others we do use so I took out the plastic bags that were in this bottom drawer. Put this, this in here, move some of this stuff around. I need to wipe this out, but yeah, just try and find better homes for certain things. So I thought I would record it and just do like a montage of me, I guess just reorganizing everything. I just finished I'm gonna show you the progress these are the cups that I am donating I need to wrap them up to take them to Goodwill I didn't end up using that container so I'm probably gonna return it but down here 
just have all my daily supplements and then all of the Tupperware is down here so all of our meal prep ones that we kind of use on a regular basis lids for bowls um, Tupperware that we don't really use in the back right here just our mixing bowls and then the lids are in this cabinet and then some extra bakeware stuff like that our food saver and then some extra like pots back there up here all of our cups yetis plastic cups and then i'm really glad i got this container because i almost didn't and it's perfect for all of our lids and then I have some seasonal mugs over there and then just like an extra random mug right there. And this one didn't really change much, but I'm gonna probably get some more mugs to fill right in there, but. And our cabinets are literally such weird heights. So this is the only spot that this fits because all of our cabinets hit right here or they're scraping the top of this. So I don't wanna mess it up. So I just moved some stuff around, put the baskets that were in that one down here and stuff back there. This top one didn't change much. I just kind of picked up stuff back here and then put some knives over here. And then this one looks a lot better. I wish I could put the other one of these right here, but the drawer is too narrow. So I guess for now that's fine. That stuff back there. And then this drawer, which I like a lot more. This has stuff that we don't use all the time, but it's right here just in case we need it. Okay, now that I finished organizing, I finally got in a new water filter for the coffee machine. I've just been pressing. It keeps displaying a message. package from La Colombe. I mentioned a few vlogs ago that I wanted to try their coffee. I've just kind of been sick of the blue bottle coffee and I want to try something new and I was drinking their cold brew a few weeks ago when I ran out of coffee beans. So this is the one that I got and I'm really excited to try it. It has notes of milk chocolate, nuts, and brownie. And I think it's one of their top rated blends or flavors. I'm really excited to try it. I'll let you guys know, I just actually used the last of the coffee beans this morning. So we get to try these tomorrow. Okay, it's a little bit later. Well, actually it's a lot later. It's 6:20. I just finished doing my hair and makeup a little bit ago and then I sat on the couch and watched a YouTube video but now since it's starting to get closer to dinner I need to figure out an outfit. I'm between two outfits so I don't know which one I'm gonna pick yet. Do I, I don't even think I mentioned exactly where we're going to dinner but we're going to dinner tonight to celebrate my friend's birthday and we're going to Kabuki Sushi which is probably one of my favorite sushi restaurants and they just recently renovated it within the last few years and now it looks so good on the inside and it's just a fun atmosphere and they have really good sushi good drinks and we're going with just a great group of people so i'm so excited to go and celebrate taylor for her 26th birthday and my two friends are younger than me i'm 26 Six, but I turned I almost said 27 I turned 27 in a few weeks actually and so my friend Maya just turned 26 in February so I'm like always like the first one to change ages and we're only the same age for a few weeks and then I go and get older now let's figure out what to wear because I don't know and Maya and Jake are about to be here and then we're gonna drive to Kabuki together. So let's try and figure out an outfit. They're probably about to text me that they're here. It hurts. It hurts your arm to hold up the camera. It's so funny. Okay, so I'm kind of between a dress and like jeans and a top. This is the dress. So it, I think I'm just gonna go with the dress, honestly, because it's easy and I don't know, but like the top would be cute too, but I don't know if I want to wear this 
for like my birthday. I got a dress for my birthday dinner, which we're actually going to the same spot for my birthday dinner in a few weeks, but I had it first. I claimed it first. And then Taylor just last minute decided that she wanted to go to Kabuki for her birthday. So um, we're going to the same spot with basically the same group of people in two weeks for my birthday. <laughs> and it's just, it's kind of funny, but it's a really good restaurant. I don't know if I want to wear this other top for my birthday dinner or if I want to wear this dress. I'm not going to show you, but I have it hanging literally right here. Um, so I think I'm just going to end up going with this dress and calling it a day. Okay, doing a little outfit of the night. I have Maya. She's going to do her outfit too because it's cute. But I ended up going with the dress. It's from Pretty Little Thing. I've worn it before for a little date night with Christian, but I originally bought it for California and never ended up wearing it. So it's that and then just some heels and then I'm wearing my usual David Yerman ring. I got this Lily Class hand chain and then the two beaded bracelets are from Bella Adar and then a Lily Class pinky ring and then these hoops are also from Lily Class. Maya, you want to do your outfit? Do you want to do it yeah, in there? Yeah, oh, Okay. Hey guys. <laughs> what am I doing? Like where it's from? Yeah. Top is from Zara. It's tucked all the way in. It's actually up to here. The skirt is kind of like a beachy. You can't really tell beachy material, but we're wearing an outfit. It's black. This is from Princess Polly. And the shoes are these little heels. I don't remember where I got these. I want to say Princess Polly too. Uh, I'm wearing the same purse as Lauren. Oh, yeah. yeah. Same purse. Same purse. And then my earrings. And this is probably from Lily Class too. And then the Yerman ring that we pretty much all have. Those are the fits. Yeah, I don't know how to stop. <laughs> I'm about to go get a pedicure. I called and booked an appointment to get a pedicure. So I'm about to go do that. It's at a place called Boutique. I've been before, but I haven't been in a really long time. It's Winter Park area and it's a really nice salon. I'm gonna donate some stuff as well. Anyways, that's what's going on. I drank a little bit too much last night <laughs> and um, I was definitely feeling it this morning if I'm being honest but the show must go on so we're, we're we're vlogging i'm drinking a spin drift right now but i don't know what color i'm gonna get at the nail salon i'm kind of deciding between white or i don't know i think i just want to go back to white it's such like it's a safe color so i think i'm just gonna get white it's also starting to rain i don't know if you can hear that and my umbrella's broken Okay, this should be fun. And then after my nail appointment, I'm just gonna go to Publix and pick up some stuff for lunches for the week and maybe some like fresh fruit and that's about it. And then come back and just hang out and chill. I saw this quote on Instagram and it said, stop spending Sunday preparing for Monday, enjoy your day off. So yeah, I'm kind of like preparing, but I'm really gonna take advantage of like enjoying my day off and relaxing and really just trying to chill and hang out. So I'm gonna be super mindful of that and really just try to just relax. Not every day has to be super productive and that's something that's hard for me to grasp. So I had a really chill morning. We went and got lunch. I came back. I'm doing a little laundry, but um, and I'm getting a pedicure, which is kind of like a self-care. And then we're going to go to the grocery store because we have to, so I can have lunch stuff. But I'm going to come back and just maybe I'll watch a movie. I don't know what movie, but maybe I'll watch one.
Okay, it's a lot later. I've been sitting at my computer editing a video and linking some stuff for that video and it's currently uploading and I'm gonna post it tomorrow. I got this new tea that I'm excited to try. I got it yesterday. It's this lemon balm tea and it's by Traditional Medicinals and I got it from Whole Foods and I got it because it's good for like calming down. I read the reviews and a lot of people say it helps with anxiety, which I don't feel like I really struggle with, thank goodness, but I do struggle with having a good night's rest often and consistently and this tea supposedly calms the nervous system so i thought i would give it a try and i'm excited to try it tonight so after dinner i'm gonna come back and take this and then at the end of the vlog i'll put in how well my sleep was or if it created any sort of benefit to a nighttime routine or how i felt after drinking it so i'll let you guys know i'm excited to try it and have it. 